That red? Yeah. What we're going to do, we're going to put for next week, just because I want to make it easier for you on the chords, I'm going to put a one finger G on the third fret, first string, and with my right hand, excuse me, I'm going to pick, let's going to show you this. Everything's backwards, yeah. Here we go. Thumb on the, so the index finger, or first finger is going to be on the second string, and the middle finger, or this uh, second finger I call it, is going to be on the first uh, first string. The thumb is going to go between the fourth and the third. And it goes like this. Thumb on the fourth, index finger up on the second string. Then thumb comes down to the third, and then the middle finger comes up on the first string, and it sounds like this. I'll do it real slow, and you can play it right after I do. And that's just playing it once. What we want to do I want you to practice it and maybe play it about this fast by the time you come back. As soon as it's over, we start again. Does that make sense? All right. When do I start? Do I just do it open or not? What's that? No, you're going to have it on the one finger G. Okay. And I said that on there. I said one finger G, and you could see my finger on there. Okay. And the chords of Two Cats in the Cradle. Now that I'm not on it anymore, what was it? Um, and then it was. I can't even remember what it was now. Where is it here? Cats in the Cradle? A, C, D, A, okay? Well, and the main thing is, those are all easy for you, right? Yeah. The one that you need to probably see more than anything. And I don't know how you want to do these strums. You can do it like that, that's kind of double, or you can go... Part that will be hard for you is when we do the walk down and it goes and you go. so what that is that's all in a sixth string it's like a G chord I'm gonna play it the way you had it here and then you hit the bass note here and we're gonna just get farther away I'll get it all in there and then the, in, the um, index finger on the second fret sixth string and then then to an E minor. We're going to Travis pick this uh, eventually, but I think it's enough to think about just the left hand on this. Well, I got this is the same video. We're still on the video. I know. So, and I already put the Travis, I already put the um, Travis pick practice on there. I'm not going to put the Travis Pick playing a song because I, I don't expect you to come back here Travis picking a song by next week, right? So we'll work on getting that together next week because you'll have practiced your Travis Pick with a simple chord and you'll, this will be second nature. So when that's second nature, then we put the chords on the left hand, we practice the chords individually and this individually, and then next time you come back, we put them both together and play like a... Does that make sense? All right. So, but for now, the, the, the hard one's going to be this G. So G strum, F sharp on the sixth string, strum, and then D minor strum. And that'll be four beats. This is one, two. Play that E minor right from there. It's 
easiest to just pick up the third finger and take the index finger and move it up here to the fifth string, uh, the fifth string, second fret, and C. right and then a, a G C D so the Travis picking, and we covered, and we did not cover the notes on the next two strings. Can you look at those in Maggie's book for me and learn those? And then we'll know these two, and then these two, all the way up to the fifth fret or fourth spider. Okay. Right? And that'll be enough for next week. Between this or and for two weeks, yeah, two we're going weeks. two yeah, weeks. So yes. All right, and also you can call me. You, if you want to talk to me. Have your mom or dad call me, all right? Because okay. I always go through the grown-ups and have them okay. have them he call. Have a cell phone. <laughs> yeah, so so he could talk to mom or dad. You could call me and say you know, he has Magnus has a question for you. And okay. Put it off to me, okay. All right. Sound good? Okay. All right. So we're doing practice. Hard.